St. Albans loves to eat. It's like there's a certain feeding time for Franklin County. <laughs> The best place to eat by far around here. It's comfort food, you know, like your family would cook. People come in here, I want them to feel love and taste great food. I think the best food comes from people who love what they're doing. Tom Murphy is a gentle, kind, big man. Anywhere he goes, he just makes people feel purposeful. Very inspiring. I looked up to my dad for everything. If you walk into any one of our bathrooms at Twigs, you will see our core values on the wall. I was taken into the bathroom once. I have been shown the core values. Oh, yeah, I was taken in the bathroom. Of course I was. Why the bathroom time, right? If we can live by our core values when things are at their lowest, at the worst point, we can live with them when they're at their best. Showtime. I'm going to do it. Most people, they're coming from work to work. And I pointed out to people, your job is to take a break, become mindful, become present, have some dinner, and then go to work. They all have the same infectious energy. I've never been in a place that is that attentive to the customer. It'll change the way you think about food, about community. There is no reason in this restaurant why anybody should ever need anything. Like, this is our home. We check in on everybody. So when people come into Twigs, not only do I want them to feel like they own the place, but I want them to feel like they're really part of the community. I want to make them feel cared for and nurtured and like family, you know? Not too much. They come here to see the staff and to see their friends. This is kind of like a meeting ground for people in the area. And he's got paint nights going on in the back room. He's got comedy nights. It's endless, the uh, number of people that he has coming in here to perform. You no, know, it's not how much this place makes in a year. It's, you know, the joy and the purpose it gives people. I feel at home here. My mom is like probably the glue of this restaurant. Everything here, she has a huge part in. I've seen the restaurant give my, my children the like real life learning experience. It gave me and my siblings the best work ethic you could possibly ask for. I love the way that people appreciate Abby. Yeah. She's the kind of 20-year-old I wish I could have been. The girl's seen everything. She knows every aspect of the business. She's 20. She runs this restaurant, hands down. Dude, she is a boss. <laughs> it's about, she's a very talented and gifted person. Before I left for basic training, I was kitchen manager. She can do anything. She ran the show. I think this place, it shaped me. Claudia is the mouthpiece of the restaurant. Hey. Claudia is very often found sitting at her tables. Since she's been a little kid, she just would climb up on your lap. I'm not saying this just because she's my sister. She really, really does care for people. And I even have asked people, I'm like, is, is she pouring way too much on? And people ask for her. I see her name pop up in reservations. Claudia, please. Out of all the kids, Thomas, more people say that kid's different. Oh my god. People slip money into his hand as a busboy. I see him hustling out there. He's such a freaking hard worker. He's like a little machine, and he does this, and he just snipes stuff. Thomas with well, the suspenders, he created a movement. Dude, you rock, you're rocking the suspenders. It's just a, a way with being comfortable with being uncomfortable. He wears these suspenders to connect with the girls. What 13-year-old boy would not like working with all these women? Everyone who walks in these doors is family. Every customer, and especially the employees here, are all family. Carrie's become the mo one of the most important people outside of Abby to me at that restaurant. I am so thankful for Carrie. I don't know what I would do without Carrie. Because I know when I'm not there, Carrie's got my back. Tom and the girls and Thomas are like some of the only family I probably have, like real, true family. So to know that there are people who are genuinely committed to this place, it makes my heart happy. If you've been told to go to Twigs and you didn't go, you're just gonna kick yourself. If you are within driving distance of St. Albans. Burlington. Swanton. Montpelier. Georgia. Fairfield. What the heck, Rutland. You have to come to Twigs. It's your restaurant. We'd love to see you. Come to Twigs now. <laughs> yeah. 
wonderful soul here.